greatness. It's just something we made up. Somehow we've come to believe that greatness is a gift reserved for a chosen few, for prodigies, for superstars. And the rest of us can only stand by watching. You can forget that. Greatness is not some rare DNA strand. It's not some precious thing. Greatness is no more unique to us than breathing. We're all capable of it. All of us. Some people are told they were born with greatness. Some people tell themselves. If greatness doesn't come knocking at your door, maybe you should go knock on its door. Sometimes greatness is about overcoming insurmountable adversity. Sometimes it's just fun. Greatness isn't always measured in tenths of a point. It's a bit bigger than that. Sometimes greatness is something you plan. But most of the time, it's just something you try. It's easy to think greatness is only something you see on TV. Unless, of course, greatness is watching TV. Greatness is a scary thing. Until it isn't. If we think greatness is supposed to look a certain way, act a certain way, and play a certain way, we certainly need to rethink some things. Is it speed or endurance? Does it happen in two hours or four or six? Is it finishing strong or barely finishing? Yes. Is greatness worth fighting for? What do you think? If we face our fears, it means we're pointed in the right direction. Even if that direction is upside down. It's not the biggest stadium in the world. Not the biggest players either. But the pursuit of greatness is kind of big enough, isn't it? You don't need an official court, an official net, or official uniforms to be officially great. Greatness speaks for itself. Once it learns to talk, Greatness needs a lot of things. But it doesn't need an audience. Some measure greatness in precious metals, like iron.
Greatness is not born. It's made. If you'd like to tell the guy with the sword he's not great because he's not famous, be my guest. There are no grand celebrations here. No speeches, no bright lights. But there are great athletes. Somehow we've come to believe that greatness is reserved for the chosen few. For the superstar. The truth is, greatness is for all of us. This is not about lowering expectations. It's about raising them for every last one of us. Because greatness is not in one special place. And it is not in one special person. Greatness is wherever somebody is trying to find it. <laughs>